welcome. Excuse me, sir, but this is not an internet cafe where you can browse all you want for free. Well done. Apu, why do you still talk like that? Well, we aren't going to start quite start the game yet because we're... Wait, no, what happened? What happened to Apu? What happened to Apu? Apu, you can't sound like that anymore. Homer, you're not allowed. He's not allowed to talk like that anymore. Help. The humans are about to escape. Get your paws off me, you, you dirty ape. He can talk. We're going to talk. get he copyright can talk. strike. He can talk. He can talk. He can... <laughs> Sorry. Well, anyway. You can't just put Simpsons content in the feed. I just did. Began oh, no. when Oberly oh, entered oh, a restricted God, zone this? between two oh, security no, fences this. outside the chimp enclosure. Two adult <laughs> male chimp. chimpanzees apparently became angry, grabbing Oberly and dragging him halfway under the barrier as he fought desperately to stop them. The animals pushed Oberly away from the fence, using the opening to escape. As oh, tourists man. looked on in horror, the they chimps dragged Oberly 100 no, feet into out. a public space and mauled him. When <laughs> One more time, one more time. Two security time, fences the, the outside chimps. the chimp enclosure. Two adult male chimpanzees apparently became angry, Thank you for grabbing the sub. Oberly and dragging Thank him halfway seen, under the uh, barrier. Sir, I was asking you this before the stream began. Have you seen the uh, those photos of the uh, the chimps without hair? Yes. And you see how fucking buff they are underneath all that? Nim's yes. The longest recorded oh. sentence was, Give orange okay. me, give eat orange me, eat orange, give me eat orange, give me give eat orange me, eat orange, me, give me eat orange, 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 give me you. Give me you. Give you me, give orange now. Me, you, you orange, see? give me, eat orange. Sir, so, please look up the video of uh, Coco the gorilla talking about climate change. I am genuinely Before we afraid begin of chimps. This Thank you, sir. Terrifying tale of ape and Yeah, we, we only did like one song, so we could we could definitely we have time. Uh, we have time while well, you get seated and you learn more about these these I dreadful animals know. and the power <laughs> they hold. Okay, yeah, th this is real, guys. <laughs> <laughs> guys, you have to share this. Please share it. It is so I important. Am flowers. Animals. You give orange I now. Nature. You give orange. Me eat orange. Me give orange. Very hungry. Me earth food. Love the earth. But man. You friend. Is orange. Well, yeah. Look at how you're talking, idiot. Stupid. You're the stupid one. I'm sorry. Why you it teach Coco language? <laughs> <laughs> why you teach? Why you teach me how to be sad? <laughs> The this earth. was shot over like 24 Help. hours. The earth. Hurry. Protect the earth. <sighs> Nature. Protect. Sees you. Earth. Thank My you. final message. Goodbye. Coco is dying. <laughs> is, this just, is this just a music video now? Wait, what's going on? Coco's just... about to sing. <laughs> it's just a music video now? Oh my God. Why does it sound like Jimmy Buffett? Coco, your voice is so important. Coco, why do you sound like Jimmy Buffett? Chimp Eden's an axe in paradise. She tore off her owner's face and it ain't nice. I saw, I looked up Travis the Chimp, that lady really got her face ripped off. It's like you laugh at the concept of a chimp doing that, but then you actually just, like see it. Coco and you're like, oh with man. Cardiac music in the background. Oh no. Oh, Rebby Ribbit, thank you so much. Could I please have audio on your end, uh, Serb? Yeah, no, you gotta you? hear this song, sorry. I gotta hear Coco's Lament. Yeah, about heard... the earth. Yeah, okay, wait, wait, what is this? Okay, here we go. I didn't think I didn't think that this song would go on for this. I thought we were gonna start immediately after, but yeah, you have to hear this. Oh, okay, ready. This is Jimmy Buffett music. <laughs> Can a monkey give you the will to live?
This oh is my just God. cheeseburger in paradise. This is this is like retirement home food court music. This is cheeseburger in paradise. I. <laughs> Ooh, we're having a dance off at the retirement home. Thank you, Coco lover fans. <laughs> Video Coco, education of Coco, music, the promise. <laughs> the promise. This music took about yeah no this is a welcome to our band of eight people. Wow. With the fonts, Steve Garlfand and produced Bell, by, Stevie produced Silver. Produced by Gaspar No. The Gorilla Foundation. Coco as the voice of nature. Wow. Oh wow. <laughs> Coco pets the dog she names Smile. <laughs> Oh man, that poor gorilla. Coco's tribute to Robin Williams. Me. What? No. What is that? <laughs> no, I'm not. Don't click it. No, there is no way that gorilla can understand what what happened when that man Coco died. Coco love the earth. <laughs> you say don't. Proto birth. Click it. You don't. You say don't. Oh, click you clicked it. it. Oh no. I recently had a mind altering experience communicating with a gorilla. I was in a film. Do you know what a film is, Coco? <laughs> Laughter. Coco understands spoken English and uses over a thousand signs to share her feelings and thoughts. No, no, she doesn't. She's a, a gorilla. She is reacting to stimuli. That, yeah, no, they do not understand that. Wow. Coco cannot understand the scope of something like climate change. When she started eating my glasses, I realized we are much more sim- Oh, she actually put them on. Interesting. Oh, hey, there you, there you go. Uh, that, that is interesting. Wow. Coco started, oh think God. started thinking that she was Robin Williams. Why funny man dead? Why, why genie free? Why genie free? <laughs> why adult- in, Why adult you man- You in movie. You in movie, yet you hear. <laughs> Why adult man named daughter Zelda? Okay, where, where did you guys all go? In the kitchen? Or... Do you think he thought he was actually communicating with the ape? Um, uh, I think that if you brought, brought me into that, like, uh, like an enclosure allowed me to interact with an ape, and like it's like, oh, this is what this all means. I'd probably like, I'd probably buy it. I'd probably feed into I'd it. I probably. I mean, I it, it would be funny. I, I wouldn't be that I wouldn't get that cynical if I was like in that ex in his shoes. This was probably honest. filmed in the '90s. It was a better world. People were going to be moved by an ape. Yeah, we had zoo like books the, back then. We had I feel zoo like books. the teacher from like I feel like Beavis and Butthead's teacher, where he's like, "It's okay to be moved, Beavis." It's okay to be moved by an ape, Beavis. Maybe an ape can teach us so much more than a person. Anyway, we're going to get into the game now. Coco says Israel is not legitimate. Okay, here, here we are. I I know nothing about this game. I know nothing about its work. It's geopolitics, sir, but I wouldn't expect you to understand. What, Rise of Kong? <laughs> what are the geopolitics of Skull Island? Okay, why is Kong making that po He doesn't look very big, I have to say. Look at, look at the foliage. Could you could you please uh, stream the game to me, sir? I so I, I did. Could, uh, uh, oh, oh, you did. Thank you so much. Okay, now we're good. All right. D okay, is there any background on this game that you can share with uh, the fan? Um, yeah, it took one year of game development. Put the game on low settings. Yes, master. Oh, no, master. we got... Yes, master. Yes, master. No, we got to see the best graphics available. Uh, that's a good point. What's the angle, chat? We gotta ask chat what they want. I no, think we gotta see the best angle humanly possible. I think everyone else played them on high, though. We would be the first people to play it on low. Hmm. High, 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 low. V-sync on, high, high. Yeah, all right, everyone. That's a yeah, lot of everyone, high. Everyone's yeah, demanding not. the graphics. Nothing worse than when you boot up the game and there's <laughs> no, no graphics. No graphics. That's the worst part about gaming, when games have no graphics. That's why I never That's got to the... draw for it. Have, yeah. uh, have you been looking at people on Twitter talking about the new Spider-Man game? Uh, in what angle? About, like, it's like, oh, man, it has no cops. Or what? No, they're just like, uh, you know, there's a gra- there, You know what? The graphics just aren't good enough. What do you mean? There's just they're no not graphics? Gonna get, they're not gonna get any better. Yeah, it's like... Graphics look. don't get better. 
like we hit the plateau this, this four years ago. This almost sounds like it's about to like go into the Halo theme. <laughs> wait, wait, let's listen to that. Da, 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 da. We're about to get into a Warthog, baby. No, but um, when it comes to games like Spider-Man, I, when it comes to graphics, I don't really care if something looks really real. Like, I saw Red Dead Redemption 2. That's as good as it really is going to get when with When it me, comes man. to graphics, I don't care. Hold it's got to be thought, stylized. Folks. Let's go. Yep. Hold that thought. Hold that thought. Let's see how much we care. <laughs> there are stories of gods ruled by fanatics. In the age of ancients. Years ago, I was Chinese. <laughs> and fantasy stories told decades ago. However, the stories of this age-old idols are passed on. Oh, graphics are equal. Let's boot this. Oh up. hell yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> this land was called Australia. This is called Tutorial Island. <laughs> Game sounds a bit low. I'll raise it in a bit. Raise it. After this, we got we got subtitles. Oh, we're just getting settled. Have existed long before anyone could even recall them. Still, the survival of the Kongs against larger and more ferocious creatures. How upset were you when you discovered that dinosaurs had uh, feathers? Oh, it like ruined dinosaurs for me. Like finding out that they're actually just stupid birds. That sucks. Like, I found it, like, I loved dinosaurs when I was a kid. I was so, like, my imagination was so sparked by Jurassic Park. And then finding out that, like, oh, yeah, they're actually just weird, stupid birds. It sucks. It's it's so disappointing. <laughs> it's like... It's a Reddit scam. Man, I hope it is. Of all the things I, I hope it's a Reddit scam, it's fucking that. But it doesn't look yeah. likely, likely, because I can see it. That's the exact kind of thing that would fucking disappoint me. It's like if you're a kid and you like f like watch Jurassic Park and then you f wait what the fuck are we just are we, oh all right with the game starting yeah well, complete with poppin I still oh man <laughs> oh wow <laughs> we're in the Kong all right here we here room. we go welcome to Kong here I oh, am oh my god well there's Kong everyone the the titular character Kong all right let me raise he the... looks so t he looks really small <laughs> he looks yeah he looks he is really all right. Let me raise the volume a little. Let's get the uh, the audio under control. Are we loud enough? Is the game loud enough? We're loud enough. The game, it's the game. I'm gonna put it up to 64. How's that? Yeah, that's good. Looks good. All right, you can move. All right, so this is this feels very much so like Gollum already. I this I am... plays like Gollum. Oh my God. Okay, can you bunny hop in this? Let me see. This is an examination of what bad video games are. This oh. is... I'm already... Are they... Are they trying to do, like, cell shading in this? Are they? Let's get a close look. Is that his teeth? Alright. Oh my god. Let's look at this character model. Does he ever blink? Is he an unblinking... Co he is... He does not blink. The character model <laughs> does not blink. <laughs> His hair looks like like the top of Bart Simpson's head when they try and make him 3D. Night storms are a bad omen in times of crisis, and the Kongs do it well. They're talking about the Kongs exactly how they talk about Coco the gorilla, which the is awesome. The, the son of Kong. Had yet to return from hunting. You mean I'm a girl? Oh no. The mother, fearing the I'm a girl. Decided to venture out. In search of her family. She's angry! Is there, is there like lore that I'm missing here? Is, is I, like... do, I feel like I've missed the past day worth of exposition. Yeah, wait, it's just a big monkey that lives on an island. I don't. I don't what really are care. these? Who oh are my these? god! <laughs> birds! Right at you. Birds! Birds! Fuck them up! They're dead. <laughs> There's more! For no reason. <laughs> There's more! She's like, man, my husband didn't come home from work yet. Time to kill some birds. 
Oh, we can do a slam attack! Okay, I... Slam attack! Have you ever... Yeah. Have you ever watched that Donkey Kong 3D uh, cartoon? Oh, yeah! Oh my god, it does look like that. Do you want... All right. After we get some gameplay in, we have to watch one song in that because it is so freakish how he sings in that. I don't know what's happening to me. me. <laughs> For no he's got reason. A beautiful, he's got an absolutely beautiful singing voice. It is. They did not have to cook that hard. All right. What, what did that tell me to do? I have to smash this, right? Yeah, his singing is beautiful. Q. Thank you. Q. That is... Okay, what goodbye, is this goodbye, related rocks. to? What, 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 what Kong-related property is this related to? Skull Island, maybe? The before four. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, 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 Kong, I thought my Skull Island. Kong right. got stuck. Oh, no. Kong Skull Island. I never saw that, but people said they liked it. Did, like... Has America figured out how to do, like, kaiju yet? I don't know. Didn't we do Pacific Rim? Yeah, but I, Pacific Rim's kind of mid. A lot of people liked it, so I, I mean, I would fall, I would, it, I mean, if that's the high watermark, then I guess the answer would be no. But I think that's the high watermark right now. I'm kind of sympathetic towards, like, the 1997 Godzilla, because I grew up with it, but, like, he's too small in that movie. <laughs> That's, you ever see the fucked up looking baby Godzilla? I love that guy. Oh, son of God. Yeah, the Godzilla son, where he gets hit in the head with a rock. Yeah, he's just like a little weird looking stuffed animal. God, like, if you go back and you watch those Japanese Godzilla movies, like, half of that is just like Japanese people in business meetings and like doing public apologies. I was hanging out with, um, Cam, Cameron, uh, Pot about List at the barcade, and we were playing the Godzilla. Um, pinball game and he told me this story about how one time on the set of one of the kaiju movies one of the guys in one of the uh, enemy costumes, one of the kaiju costumes had a heart attack and they had to operate on him while he was in costume <laughs> oh my god we gotta open him up <laughs> we gotta open him up we gotta open him up right now shouts out to Cam and uh, the boys but um yeah no no could you imagine if you were like if, if you were like your cast of like being Barney or whatever and, like, you have a heart attack on set, they have to rush you into the hospital. And they have to, like, cut you over. It's like, we can't remove him from the suit. We can't remove him from the from the Yo Gabba Gabba suit or he'll die. We have to do the operation as is. He's clinging on to life. He's clinging to life. He's trying to stay in character. We can't take him out of the suit. You read about, like, Disneyland stuff or, like... If characters collapse, there's, like, procedures that you have to go through. Really? Yeah. No, if, like, you have, like, hand signals and everything. Because the magic can't be broken. If you die on set, there has to be a reason. <laughs> really? Oh, oh, they've got, like, v they've got, like, Viet Cong tunnels that you can, like, Oh, I heard about that. Into. That I know. Yeah. That they is have, like, that a full-scale cool. fucking, like, guerrilla war, like, network underneath Disneyland. If Disney wasn't an evil corporation, people would find that a lot cooler than it is. Like, not not cooler than- people would find it as cool as it actually is. Because that is so cool. Yeah. Like, they have, like, they ride around in little golf carts to get from place to place, so they can maximize the effectiveness of meet and greets and whatever. And you ride oh, around in a like, golf cart, so it's not like a death march, so that's kind of neat. Disneyland's got tons of, like, funny shit like that. Like, like, they've got their own jail. Really? Yeah, you can how, go to how Disney big? Jail. How big is it? I don't know. Is it just like it's a drunk like, yeah. tank, I guess? I, I would think it I, is. I'd imagine, yeah. I can't imagine being so rich that you go... If you go to the drunk tank at Disneyland, you got to be rich, because those beers are not cheap, I guarantee you. Oh, no. One of the things that my, I learned about my dad is that he would take us to some family events just as an excuse to, like, get drunk and people watch. Like, he would go to Epcot and do, like, the beer stuff and go to Renaissance fairs just so he could, like, get cheap beer and, like, laugh at costumes and, like, stage plays. Oh, man. That's awesome. And I was like, oh, man, okay, so it makes sense. Oh, I hated going to the Renaissance fair, but now that I don't know why my dad did that. fell out of the map. <laughs> He's gone now. He's gone. Dudes do rock. 
That's such a dad thing, like just getting drunk at the Ren Fair and like harassing the puppet show. Yeah, that was what my dad did. He would harass the puppet show. <laughs> it was awesome. Just talking back to the animals. <laughs> and he, no, no, he would go to like the petting zoo and he would just like, he would just like walk up to like the, Jesus Christ. Fuck you! Oh my god, you're getting fucked up. <laughs> Did you see them like get juggled oh and not god. have an animation? You're fucking him up. My dad would love going to the petting zoo drunk. It was awesome. Oh man. That rules. One oh my god. One time I brought my dad like a pretzel. We were at Oktoberfest and my dad he was like, hey son, he was like, you know, he's been imbibing. And um uh, he uh, was like, hey, son, can you get me a pretzel? And I, was, I brought it back to him. I was like, hey, dad, here it is. He, he grabs a pretzel, takes the plate, and squishes the pretzel. He's like, eh! And he starts just laughing. <laughs> and he oh, just starts man. eating it. He just, like, smashes the pretzel and makes a weird Adam Sandler noise. Do you remember, just, like, like the first out. time... Do you remember the first time you ever saw your parents drunk and how weird it was? Um, I probably saw it from a young age because my dad would go camping with his college friends. Um, upstate New York all the time, so he would be like drunk and uh, high plenty of oh, times for me as a kid. And the thing is with him is I didn't notice because he's not belligerent in any of those. He's just really peaceful, really zen. So I wouldn't know. Oh. This is... my, oh, my no. dad I, I remember I was like, I was like nine, and we were at like a like a fortieth birthday party, and he was just on the wine, and I was like, Dad, what's you're acting weird. We got a video like, share, by the way. He had like he had like a video camera, and he was like putting a shrimp in front of it. <laughs> like, look, look, drunk it's Sally the are... shrimp. Whoa, dads are cool. Dads are cool when they're drunk. They are. What, well, what, what, what do you? What do you? It depends on the. It depends on the drunk. And it depends on the dad. Yeah. Okay, pause the game, sir. We have a video share coming in. What are stories? Oh my god, what is this? <laughs> oh my god. They were everywhere. <laughs> Let me just kill this character. I just killed Nasser from uh, Goodbye Volcano High. <laughs> <laughs> Monkey emergency caught on Kitan like tape. What other weird stuff did my, did my dad do? I mean, no, it's just a general vibe, I guess. He would... <laughs> yeah, no, we would just Your go to upstate. seemed really chill when, we, like, we met. He was... All, he's awesome, dude. He's, he's like a real sitting in his chair watching the game type, like type of dad. He, he's probably doing that right now. You, would, you wouldn't expect him to be ex-military, either. Oh, uh, my dad just golfs. He's I have a golf dad. My dad just goes to like the local like lodge and just hangs out with other fifty year olds. Um, he, <laughs> as it turns out, he hated his job so much that like he got he gets vertigo from leaving the house now because he uh, hated because he, he got so used to like staying at home from COVID because he hated his job. So like we were worried he had like a medical thing. He's like, oh no! As it turns out, your dad just really loves like staying at home and being retired. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Any raps asks, uh, Rocky, what are your thoughts on the MonsterVerse movies? Uh, I like the 2014 Godzilla. I don't like Godzilla King of the Monsters, and I haven't seen any of the other movies. I actually kind of like the 2014 Godzilla. What do I do for this? I skipped it because I was too busy talking about my my dad. You're talking about your dad. This is a dad stream. This is my dad. This game could be about dads. Yeah, I, I guess. Q. Are you the son of Kong? Is that why you're like a baby? I think maybe I gotta go closer. Jump Q. I am pressing Q. Huh. Jump R. That's oh, there you go. stupid. So many buttons that don't matter. This is Mom of Kong. What? So have you noticed that there's like no, like geometry? Um, in what way? Well, it's like it's just a straight line. 
Yeah, no, it's this is this is like this actually is a baby game to be honest. This reminds me a lot of Trespasser. Like it like it looks Actually Trespasser probably looked better than this. In Tab terms of its and levels. Then space. This sucks. That's oh my God. that is that is a weird but no, 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 no. Kong's, I like it when we Kong's play stuck. like really bad when we play bad games and you're like surprised they're bad. Well, every time you play a game like it's bad, it's like you would think that they would stop making bad games by now, but no. Yeah, there was like an article that came out about this that was like, uh, this was made in one year and they were overworked. And it's like, well, clearly they were not worked hard enough. Yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> yeah, for real. I bet. Let's let's make a game. Let's. What do we do? How how is? There is no way I can clear to Springfield Gorg right now. Come oh, on. Oh man. Yeah, they're trying to get Kong out of there. Or is it like this where I I jump high? No. This I I I'm not sure how I can make this jump. Uh, Proto Birth says high on life DLC when? Oh, the we demand to, is coming. We have I no, we have to return to the actual game first and beat Oh it. god. Cuz it's locked behind the ending. Is it actually? Yeah, no. I I looked into it. Cuz I know that wow. people want to see that. All right, guys, you have 10 more hours with the sexual predator. Then you can get to the actually good stuff. When are we going to get to the fireworks factory? You know you, you know what's funny about that? Uh, how what? Ian Miles Chong is still very much so team Justin Roiland. I... You can find 15 tweets from him about cancel culture regarding it. Like, I have thought, a, like, for a long time about what that guy actually believes. I think his audience is just people who don't pay, like, close attention to things. What do you... Yeah, no, he's... Uh, he just... He's just a guy who likes to watch the numbers go up. Man, so he's basically just political James Healy? I mean, there are people who have entire political, like, journeys that begin and end with yelling at him. Yeah, that's awesome, isn't it? That's amazing. He's like, yeah, just bookending, like, your political journey. Nobody likes him. Nobody. Doesn't that's matter amazing. if you're Pepe or anything like that. No one likes him. Except Elon Musk. He's his, it took him this long to become, to finally have a friend, and it's the mod. It's, yeah. Do you remember the saga of Cat Turd? Oh, yes, I remember Cat Turd. Is it, what, what is this? Did I just kill? Oh my god, you killed the dodo. <laughs> that was that, the last that, that dodo. That was so fast. That was so fast. Nutbrain says, does he even have an audience? Who's Ian Miles Chong's core base? It's people who do not pay much attention. And they go, oh my god, I will not investigate further. God, we could we could we could go into the past recent stuff. We could go on and on about <laughs> recent political stuff, but man, we'll just Oh man. Yeah, no. Crazy, crazy world we live in. I can't believe that uh, uh, worst of all, worst of all. They made Kong Skull Island. That's crazy. That's the worst that's a game thing that's for a game for our troubled times. That, that's the worst thing that could have possibly happened in the past month. How much was this game, sir? Thirty-one dollars. Why was it thirty-one? It's actually on sale and it's normally forty. Wow, that's a bargain right there. You have to double tap space, by the way, that which sucks. Oh, oh Serb just found the double jump. No, that's not a double jump. You have to hold down a button, hold down space, and then tap space again in order to do the long jump. It is not good. Hell? It is the weirdest thing ever. It's like the dumb version of like the, the Mario 64 long jump. It is very bad. <laughs> this oh, is Oh man. This is it. This is this is it's it's intriguing in a way at like just just stop and listen to the music for a sec. Yeah, sure. Is is there no music in this game? It's just a it's just a drum drum track. It's just like all right, we got we got five minutes. Do some warm ups. That's this is nothing. <laughs> Uh, in unrelated news, Rocky, what did you think about Brendan Fraser jump scare? Ah, oh, you're referring to uh, Flowers of the Killing, 
the Flowers of the Killer Moon. Or whatever the hell that movie was called that I saw today. Uh, he's very portly in that movie. And that's, that is a three hour, twenty movie. Three hours and twenty minutes, and I don't think he wasted a single minute, but oh my god, was it long. Where do I go? Where do you go? That's a good question. Yeah, aren't you supposed to be in a jungle? What's what's going on here? We're in the mountains, I guess. The whole, I, <sighs> I'm watching you try and play this game, and I just don't quite understand. Me either. It's like, you know when a game is like 20% complete, and like you've just got the little, hey! like the model running around in like an environment? Yeah. This kind of looks like that, but like a released game. You remember that monkey evolution game that we played once? Oh yeah. I want to play killing the apes. I want to play that again. <laughs> what what made you think of that? I don't know. What could it be? <laughs> you want this ape to die? Is that it? It it wants to. <laughs> Chat, we're going to we're going to find a way to make sure that this ape dies by the end of the stream. I like that there's like two colors in this level and at no point are you like aware of where you need to go. They, they yeah, no, this is hey, hey game developers, indie game developers. A uh, little 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 something for you to l learn about. Make sure you make it Obvious where you need to go to a certain degree. Not too obvious, like the paint on ladder stuff. But, uh, it can't no, be No, by all means, by all means, put paint on ladders. Because uh, every single color in this is the same. This is... where? Like, where am I? Where are you? Are you going <laughs> forward or backwards? Like, what is this? Alright, I think that's it. That's it. Alright, uh, you might have... Go up. This All is... right, there's flowers up here. <laughs> Thank God. Thank God. A sign of progress. All right, we... What is the ge... All right, wait, wait, wait. What is the geometry of, okay, like... Okay, now we're in a forest. What's the topography of this? So I fell down a giant hole, I climb up it, and now I'm back, like... I, I don't know. It's weird. Let me... I'm on Skull Island. Skull Island. I'm a, a monkey. Place. Oh, great. Oh, I'm a monkey. Bloody hell, I'm a freaking monkey. I'm a monkey. Sir, sure, those are just birds. <laughs> it didn't attack me at first. But it would've it would have been I would have been next. Oh my god. Get over here. Did they do accurate dinosaurs? Are they like bird creatures now? I think so. Oh, that sucks. Why is that raptor glowing? He's radiant. He looks great. He's reacting to... He's rea he, he looks like he's reacting very well to the Skull Island air. What does this mean? Am I... All You're right. going into monkey mode. Monkey mode. Oh, you killed him. Never mind. They're saying it's the new golem. I wasn't there for Gollum, and I'm still fascinated by this. It's, you know, some, like... <sighs> I find this fascinating not in, like, a, a janky, funny... <laughs> Ow. Fuck you. Ow. <laughs> that was loud oh on my, my god. End. No, I find this fascinating in, like... It's not, like, really, like, million things, glitches happening at once bad, where... But like I like it's just bad game design. Like it's everything bad you could really do. I I like that shovelware is back. Like some poor kid that was like really into monkeys just got this game for. His yeah, birthday. no, no, no. I'm I'm glad that that's getting back into the ecosystem. Can we kill ourselves? What in the game or real life? Um, uh, make your pick. <laughs> no. I am a Kong, and I must scream. We need a new Tarzan game. 
Yeah, this, this is does, a, this does feel like something made by like a university student. Yeah. This is University of Phoenix. This is a game that's made by one of those guys that went to like the game developer colleges that would be in between G4 episodes. Like you'd find commercials for it on X-Play. Oh my god, video game <laughs> college. Ah! Yes. Whoa. It's a monkey baby. 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 Husband. Where's the baby? Oh. Oh! Husband! Oh, we're playing as the mother. No! 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 Oh my god, he's dead. Look at- oh my god. <laughs> Baby! No! 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 This looks like an Eiffel 65 video. I'm blue, I buddy, I but I, and I buddy, I but I, I buddy, I but I. Oh. That's the sound you're gonna make playing this game. Am I scripted to die? I, I don't think you can be it's like a like the first boss in like a Souls game. You can't beat it. Parry. Was that was that it? I don't know. But yeah, apparently. <laughs> it's the Gaw! It's the oh, iconic yeah. Gaw! Gaw. Everyone loves Gaw. I, 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 you know what? Given how stupid easy everything else is, I would think that I'm not supposed to beat this guy. It's like scripted loss. I think so. No! Oh my god. No! No! Oh! Oh no. I'm no. Lou, a buddy, a buddy, a buddy, a buddy, a buddy, a buddy, a buddy. Ah. It's like a, the blue guys from Akira. <laughs> no! Mom! Dad! Mom! Dad! Bart's dead! <laughs> oh my god. Run, child. I have anxiety! <laughs> the last survivors of the Kongs had perished. Against the fury we got, we got like, a, we got like a. Can we get fisheye lens, like a, like the a skateboarder? Fury of Call it luck, will, or destiny. The last of the Kongs had survived thanks to his parents' sacrifice and his own perseverance. If it wasn't for his father's narrow urethra, he would have had more children. I'm angry. Oh, I must become Kong. Skull Island. I must move to Skull Island. Rise of Kong. That took away his family. I don't he think apes have like a concept of revenge. He hated birds. I hate birds. Oh wait, these are meant to be dinosaurs? Oh, this, what? The, fe the oh, idea that dinosaur suck. the idea that dinosaurs are poultry is so fucked up to me. That makes Velociraptor right. that makes Velociraptors not seem like predators to me. It makes me feel like we could have taken one on. If they were just wow. chickens, we could have kicked their ass. Well, I mean, crocodiles are dinosaurs. Yeah, they just you sneak go up fight on one of those. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Have a spear? Yeah. Oh, of course. All they have to do is just sneak up on you. You just have to, bink, get it right between the eyes. Would have to Easy. Overcome the constant fear of larger, more powerful, hungrier ooh, beasts ooh. in order to survive. This is a game about PTSD and found families. He's going through eight puberty. The memories and the desire for. I'm learning more about puberty from this than I did from like Big Mouth. And wait for the Which has seven seasons, by the way. You told me this, and it's like, I've met one person who, like, was a huge fan of that show and wanted me to watch it with him. It was like a roommate that would just smoke weed all the time. Law student. Cool chick. In her 30s. Was on Tinder all the time. Nice enough. But, like, that's kind of the target audience for that. Get out me uh, head! I am having oh 80- Oh god! I'm having CPTSD attack! 
Must having flashbacks like the Punisher. Must alienate friends. <laughs> Must discard. Must. Must. Splits from friend. Friend going to hurt me. Must. Me must hurt friend first. Alright, what what else is it? What else does this game got for us? Oh, I don't know any attacks. I Oh no. It's you like forgot uh, how to fight. It's just like uh, Metroid Prime. Yeah. I have to learn it's everything. It's like a Metroid Vanya, but you're like learning how to jump. They gave me all my weapons in the beginning and I lost them. Oh no. Crabs! Oh, they're doing like the like early RPG thing where you have to go to the beach and fight crabs. That's just where you grew up in, in fucking Australia, dude. <laughs> what was the most fucked up insect you ever saw in your life? Um, there was, okay, our school got taken over by stink bugs at one point. We have those over here, though. Oh, I gotta look up exactly what it was. Hold on. Are they kind of bell-shaped? Uh, maybe. I'll, I'll look them up. We, we have those now. They're invasive. They they, they brought over here. I, I like to think that you brought them over here when you vacation, so this is your fault. No, no. It's your fault. Oh, uh, no, I don't know what they were, but they were these weird bugs that just infested the place. You mean you don't like, you've never seen like a big huntsman spider? Yeah, but huntsmen are like harmless. They're still, they still keep me out. No, huntsmen are friends. How often would you see one? Uh, pretty commonly. Interesting. Are they as big as I've seen in like those like videos? Um, maybe. Huntsman spiders aren't that bad. Uh, I once saw a couple of redback spiders in a garage and I got scared and like started crying. I would have- I would have- those, those ones can kill you. Oh, shit. Have I ever whacked a cane toad? Yes, that was a, uh, very common thing in my neighborhood. Is the we part- would get golf, <laughs> We would go and get golf clubs and we would just whack them, yeah. We probably- we probably discussed this before, but like, how like how much do you love the episode of uh, The Simpsons Bart vs. Australia? <laughs> oh, I love that one. I, that's like one of yeah, that's a classic in Australia. It's so Everyone good. Everyone loves that one. It's so good. Ten thousand dollary dues. Five hundred dollary dues. Hey, Tobias. Mr. Prime Minister. Wait, is this crap upside down chasing me? Andy. And yeah. Mr. Prime Minister! This, I'm gonna take this up with my member of parliament. Oi, Gus! <laughs> <laughs> the funny thing about those accents is that they sound like South African. <laughs> it was an emergency call from the, dra the drainage commission in Springfield. That's how you know it was a good episode. Like, people don't, get, don't argue over, like, how uh, accurate the accents are. It's just no, that funny. No. Oh There's nothing god. wrong with the bidet, is there? Oh my god, Racy. I always... Oh my god, Rand McNally. Oh my god, the small gag where they call Argentina and, and Hitler is there. Yeah. <laughs> Buenos noches, mein Führer. Yeah. <laughs> Buenos noches, mein Führer. It's so good. We have to fight oh and God, clear the crabs. zone of crabs. Oh man. Uh, Serb, have you played uh, Fallout Brotherhood of Steel? Not yet. That game is incredible because it's like, there's a desperation behind it where they're just trying to get something out the door. They're might, just trying to save their studio. That might be a me game, because I love Fallout. Oh no, but like, because I remember Josh Sawyer was like begging people to buy it because like Fallout 3 was about to get canned. The actual Fallout 3, uh, Van Buren. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that, that, that game was like 90% done. Man, I'm glad that he got finally got his flowers of New Vegas, at least. Yeah, most, like, most of the ideas ended up in New Vegas, so, you know. Just gotta, you gotta bide your time. Well, I mean, you do... Like, cause that's all you can do, but not everyone's as lucky as him. In that regard. 
Yeah. Sometimes you like end up never getting your flowers. That unfortunately happens more often. Uh, than not. did you see the Elon Musk new Vegas tweet on X, Rocky? Oh, you mean this, Twitter? This, yes. This, this dead crab is following me. That just it's just floating around. Yeah. <laughs> it, well, now it's gone. It's gone now. Monkey, monkey, run from crab. <laughs> It's really cool how he talks about how much he loves New Vegas and his writing, and like, it's obvious that Josh Sawyer fucking hates him. No, uh, that's like, him being like, oh, it's got Hegelian dialectics in it. Like, that was something I thought was clever when I was like 15. That was, I remember hearing that when I was like 15 years old and being like, oh man. I don't even know what that stuff is. This, this is so smart. Dude, Mr. House is a genius, but like, the point of that conversation is that Caesar's a dumbass. Well, here's how you know Hegelian dialectics aren't smart. Uh, one, it's it's stupid, and I never heard of what that is. I don't know what Halgian dialectics really is. I didn't know about it until Elon Musk tweeted about it. So it's stupid and gay, and uh, yeah, Fallout New Vegas is cool because you could be a you could do a BB gun build and kill people, explode their heads with BB guns. That's what's cool. That is cool. Uh, let me see. Soccer Falk. Rope kid's too pussy to publicly criticize Elon. Uh, rope kid. Josh Sawyer just wants to ride his bike and retweet my cat, okay? He doesn't want to do anything else. He does <laughs> retweet my cat, sir. Do you ever think about who, who? Who does? The creator of Fallout New Vegas. It's cool that he's just like talks and socializes with Hessa and all of our friends. Like, he's just sort that of our, cool. in our scene. Like. Yeah. That that's what's cool about it. He's just he just that's what he does with his free time. That's that like after after his like he made his game and did his writing. Um, that's what this is where he just likes to hang out. And that's kind of cool that he just happens to sit at our lunch table. You know? He's coming to the. He's been in the Twitch chat a few times. He has. He has. Yeah, he came on for uh, when I was playing Viet Cong ages ago. I could get him on, but I would say something dumb. Um. Everyone worries about I would, that. I would want to talk about, like, uh, why is Fallout bad? No. <laughs> no, bad idea. No, you just gotta, like, just make sure that, like, you're in a good headspace, that you, like, aren't, uh, that you won't slip up at. Be on your guard. It won't be, uh, it would be, like, a little bit, like, self-censored in a little bit, because you don't want to embarrass yourself even, on that, fir I'm not that first. I'm sure, like, what I would talk to him about, because I'm, I'm, I'd imagine he's probably tired of talking about New Vegas. Well, I mean, I, I asked myself about that before I ever have, have any of my guests on, you know? I think it's worth hmm. a shot. You know, you never nah, know. Nah, no, I couldn't do it. Yeah, uh, you don't got the Serb gene, then I guess. I'd I'd get stage fright with like a with like a real celebrity. I I know how you mean, man. Um, but yeah, no, it's still cool that he's just sort of around in our scene. Yeah, no, it's it's cool that he's like a guy who knows about us. I think well, that's neat. I mean, you don't think that he gets shy sometimes too? I don't know, probably. Yeah, he does. He just likes to ride his bike. I think that's nice. That's what I want to do when I'm his age. He's a, he's a, I like how he has his salt and pepper hair. Like, it's like a... Hey, he's a silver fox. He's a silver fox, that's the word. That's so fun. How do I kill this stupid fucking crab? You gotta parry it. It's, what button is it to parry? Like, this button's like to... Rocky, you are his age. I'm 29, shut up. I just I love the death animation. He just sits there. <laughs> He's like, oh. Attack its weak point for massive damage. What's the controls, man? Giant enemy crab. Make sure you submit videos, gamers. We need more no, monkeys no, no, no. destroying streets. Yeah, it it does a big flash, sir, but you have to charge it at I, that I, point. I, oh, okay. Cause this, th cause this just to me looks like another attack. Like, cause that's just a shoulder block, right? So it's just like, oh, that's not, that's nothing. Can't handle the crab. This is like dying to pinwheel. It really is, yeah. You lost to the crab. Man's getting bullied by a crab. Do you like, what's your opinion on horseshoe crabs? Don't don't know what that is. They're like the ones that look like little triobites. I guess that's a US. What did you say? Triobites. Trillobites. 
To me, they're trilobites. I, I, I'm sticking I with my pronunciation. Oh, it's a, re it's a regional dialect. From Albany, New York. Alright. You're siding with Serb, really? Trilobite. Taking Serb's side? Serb's right! Serb's oh, right! Oh, no. Yes! No, no, no. Yes! Serb's never wrong! No, oh hell. I'm being gaslit by my own damn chat. I don't know. Oh, wait, Herb, it's stop dying to the crab. It's, it's flashing glowing. red. It's glowing. It's glowing. It's doing it's glowing. it. It's doing Get it. It's help. about to do its spin attack. It's about Herb, to. Over. Everyone run! The crab's about to unleash its rage! Oh no. It's going crab to battle. unleash its rage! Good lord! Jesus fucking Christ! Crab battle. How'd you hit me? Oh my <laughs> We're facing God. the wrong way! Wait, how'd you get hit by that? I don't know. Serb versus Serb crab. Serb is not winning. Serb He's getting his ass kicked by a bird. <laughs> it's so funny that it's a fucking crab that's getting in my you're ass. Getting, you're, you're getting your ass kicked on like the tutorial beach in an <laughs> RPG. Chat, do not, I hear you're an, do not. I hear you're an adventurer. Would you do, like to go into the basement and fight some rats? Do not, do not, do not draw a picture of me sitting in the in a chair like Shinji at End of Eva, surrounded by crabs holding knives. Yeah. Do not you're draw that. Up. Do not draw me getting fucked up by crabs. You're getting fucked up by the crab rave. Do not, do not draw a picture of me being surrounded by crabs crying. Um, you will be banned in chat. <laughs> I just got here. Is this game Kino? Well, this is we're on round oh, well, three. We're on round three versus cinema, the crab. Right? This is this is some Hands form up. of cinema. Put your hands it's in your pants. Do the walk away. Now lean back. Come on. Lean back. You gotta parry the crab, sir. No, the parry button is this dash button, and I have no idea how that could possibly be a parry. Oh, wait. Maybe if I you lock hit on. Him. Oh, yeah. Now. Now you gotta parry when he's glowing. I don't know when about that. When he's glowing, Serb. It's, it really is just a dash attack, man. I, you know what? You're getting your ass kicked by the level one crab on the beach. The controls are bad. Uh, the controls are... Yeah, they are. They probably are. <laughs> they are like... No, dude, the parry is exactly the same. It's not like a, it's a different... It's the same animation, so you don't know that you're engaging in the frame window that constitutes the parry. It's just You're this. Hit it's by, this. Like, a weird... Yeah, do the ground slam on those things, sir. Oh yeah, wait. <laughs> okay, that didn't do anything. <laughs> That's not good. That's not good. Sir, you're getting your ass kicked. I don't like crabs anymore. Can you do something to those crabs when they're stunned? Can you throw them? No. What was that? I don't know. Do it again. <laughs> no, I'm getting out of here. I'm getting. I'm getting. I'm gonna eat some. I'm gonna eat some leaves. I need to go eat some roots. All right, now lock onto the crab. Okay, we are locked onto the crab now. Good. Now. Oh, maybe not. When it starts to flash, you gotta charge at it. I was trying, it. it just wouldn't listen. Oh yeah, no, no, I believe you. It's ah! dancing up. You're getting your ass beat. Oh, okay. No, 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 it's not a parry. If he does that and you do the charge attack into him, he gets stunned. That's yeah. what that is. I, I could have told you that. It's it it just 
Oh, that's it doesn't not, feel that's, good? That's not a, it doesn't You're telling me this game doesn't feel good to play? Yes. Well, now he's glowing. He's about to unleash he's his rage. He's glowing red. Crab rage. Come on. Keep your distance. <laughs> this is this is the battle for the ages. This is terrifying. Hold on, hold, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. What are you doing? No, sir, you're gonna you're gonna jinx it immediately. No, 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 no. Oh no. It's 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 mandatory. Oh god, what are you doing? I'm scared. Come on! Watch him immediately die like an idiot. I'm not gonna die to this crab. You are. <laughs> I'm not gonna die to crab wheel. Yeah! Yo! Yeah! Is is that the streamer that beat crab wheel? He did it, guys. He beat the crab. We are so back. We're back, everyone. Streamer has beat crab wheel. We did it. Kong has conquered. Use Kong points to level up at the store. Quick, everyone, tell Josh Sawyer. <laughs> we did it, Josh. Josh we Sawyer. We did it for you. Everyone, oh, we have to tell him. He needs to know. <laughs> Spend your skill points. It never told me how to do that. Why is it doing horror music right now? It's because you're about to die. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. If you die, you have to fight the crab again. Do I? Well, don't die. Oh, come <laughs> on! <laughs> don't rob me of that catharsis! Oh my god. <laughs> I love, we can just play the whole game with this music. <laughs> it becomes a creepy pasta. Oh yeah, no, there is a scary racing game that nah, it, it has to be witnessed. I can't quite describe it. The words don't find me right now. But basically, when you crash, the game starts playing horror music for the rest of the race, and oh, no. <laughs> and just start the music starts turning into organ music. Oh my god, you fell down again. I don't know. Wait, this has DLC? Yeah, I opted not to buy it. That was a mistake. The DLC was just skipping the crab fight. You can't prove that. I hate how this looks. You're saying this now? An no, hour no, 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 no. Like the, the vines. They look like crunchy noodles. <laughs> they do, don't they? And it, it, it kind of pisses me off. Chat, basically what I'm saying is I'm pissed off. Oh, I'm mad. You need to learn to hold heavy attack. Well, how do I... Cool rock, okay, by... Cool, do... cool rock! Cool rock, by the way. Yeah, nice rock, man. How do I... Oh my god, it is a Metroid Vanyo. How do I... Yeah, I was gonna ask you to repeat that. <laughs> we did play oh that Golem game. It is on we did, the YouTube. Yes. It is on the YouTube. YouTube.com slash Kimono Friend Zone. Where's the skills tab? Go to the oh, skills, skills tab. Oh, I'm so stupid. Row Rock is bigger. I only have one skill point. I can't go this way yet. Oh my god, you beat that crab for nothing. Then what What was the point? What was that for? That's like Elden Ring. That makes me- I'm actually really fucking upset about this. <laughs> Maybe you click the gorilla- I, I don't know. Map. Well, where am I? The playground. There's a lot of- Probably right around here. We're not dropping the settings. We can't. No, I'm dropping the settings. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> he just immediately does it. You didn't that. do it. Oh my god. This is sub Halo <laughs> 1. Like the PC port of Halo 1. This is bad. This is like a cereal box game. Yeah, this is Chex Quest. Chex Quest looks great though. <laughs> yeah, that's a sub Chex Quest. You oh do my the god. Math. What are you meant to do in this game? I don't know. God, Ew. Everything just looks everything in this game just looks like diarrhea. Ew! <laughs> What's this? Don't got no point to the game, man. Oh, I can't do the long jump yet. I don't like the met. I don't fucking like the Metrovania bullshit. Just let me, let me. It's like, all right, we let you be the crazy monkey, and you get to attack stuff. Um, but now you can't, you can't do that anymore. You can't do anything. Oh, Thinking. You get beat up by crabs. Um, also, by the way, we made the dinosaurs the gay kinds with feathers. All you can do is fight. Even Goodbye Volcano High had real dinosaurs. Well, they were kind of real dinosaurs, but only in the sense that they had problems, just like us. That's true. Man, that's deep. I, I kind of got a soft spot for that game as it went on. I, I, I mean, I liked yelling at it. I don't, I don't know. I don't, it I don't it kind of, much. it kind of felt like like fan fiction for something that doesn't exist. Oh come on! No, hold on. Oh my god! Sequence break. Oh, I'm I'm where I'm not supposed to. Oh no, sir! No. Oh, sir, what did you do, man? I don't think I'm supposed to be here. This looks like a homework project. When I think about Goodbye Volcano High, I think about the fan art that someone drew of us as dinosaurs. And on my shirt, it's Mr. Met, and he's a fucking dinosaur, too. That's beautiful. I love Was that. Was that the picture. fluoride brain one? No, 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 no. The Florid Brain one? No, no, no. Um, it was the one that was posted in... Yeah, it was my Sizzo's one. That uh, one was beautiful. That was the was one beautiful. that... That one was the one that we made the uh, fan art page for. Oh, yes. Iconic. No, no, no. As long as I don't take... T as long as this stream doesn't go on for two hours, I could... I, I could refund the game. Oh, boy. Yeah, we have to come in under two hours. I think that's all we're gonna get out of this piece of shit. It's fine. People wanted to see it. People wanted calm. What, Meyer RS? Bad news, sir. Get over here. What if this game gets good after two hours? <laughs> no, it wouldn't. <laughs> you take that back. We should have bought the incest game instead. Damn. The one that everyone gets mad at? And like, yeah, oh, yeah we should have just bought the incest game. Everyone's mad at it. It's just very clearly made by a female anime pervert. It's literally just made by a woman who's like... An anime pervert. Insane. Yes. And, and, and everyone that's mad at it, it's like 15. They're posting like, uh, oh, this Hello. is this. Uh, delete this. <laughs> um, can we call this person out? And it's like, what do you mean? What, what are you going to do? The cops are not going to come. They're not coming. They're not coming, yeah, man. Listen, man, if they weren't going to come for Shad, man, even though they should have, they're not going to come for the weird incest game. Actually, I think the cops did, in fact, come for Shadman. Good. <laughs> I'm glad. Good. No, no, it's because he had a weapon. That's why they came. Oh. That's why. It was unrelated to all the horrible things he drew. I know. I saw a post being like, can we please call this author out? And it's like, 
What is that gonna do? Yeah, you made a game with <laughs> incest in it. It's like she, I think she knows that. Oh yeah, no, Shadman didn't get arrested for any of his drawing crimes. He got arrested for being high on heroin and attacking a homeless person. <laughs> It's the most on-brand way to go out. Yeah, oh yeah, typical. Classic. And may he never return. Oh my god. I would I would hate to meet the kind of guy that jacks off the Shadman hentai. I... That is so unpleasant to look at. I... Jesus Christ. <laughs> Imagine being his public defender. Yeah, now my client... Now my fell down and hit their head very hard when they were 17. Well, I, my, my client my client draws real child porn and he wears an SS uniform all the time. Now, I may be a simple country lawyer, but he has anxiety. <laughs> now, I have just one question. Isn't this America? Sir, he's not American. Goddamn fuck. Fuck! <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Fuck! Can you imagine his country lawyer? Like a, like the country lawyer from like Futurama doing like the I may be a country lawyer. And just mid-trial, like he gets an objection and like the most like non-southern accent just goes, FUCK! <laughs> uh, did you see that lady who got deported from Japan for being too annoying? Yes. That was, was my wasn't favorite it pasty? Thing. Pasty, yeah. It was one of the, uh, the Dime Square women. Yes. Just got deported for just being too irritating. For taking irritating. creep shots of random guys being like, Look at this man! He is a beta around his girlfriend! And it's like, what the fuck? I like those accounts, like those trad women, because they're just constantly at war with their audience. It's beautiful. It's, it's amazing. Do you remember that? Yeah. I think of Pasty, uh, because of that one picture that someone redrew of her and all the other Dime Square women at church. And she had the funniest oh. picture out of all of them. And I had it as my avatar for a little bit. Like oh, her Pasty's face looked- Pasty is a very funny account. Like she she had like the most perfectly round face in that redrawing that like made her head look like an orange. She didn't look like that in the actual picture, but the redrawing made her look like Carl Pilkington. Oh, and I great. loved looking at it. <laughs> Genuinely a very funny person. Why did she? Why did she? Why? If why would she do all that shit in Japan then? What's the point? I'm guessing she was probably doing a bit. I think she was. I think she was yakking it up. Oh, I mean, she's. If there's like an element of kayfabe with like that account. Cause she knew that people hated her enough that like it would become a big deal. Well, people don't realize that women are joking online. Like, people never quite grow. Oh, oh, this chick's making a joke. Why did I wait? Why did I find a baby skull? Why is that a collectible? What, what, the fuck? what the fuck? What the fuck? Why was it in poop? Why did I get an achievement for finding a baby skull in poop? It was real. Uh. But yeah, anyway, I hope Shadman goes to jail and dies there. <laughs> I I hope we never are graced with his presence again. That was a that small time bit. That bit where he came back, he made like a girl post like on his Twitter account, like wearing like his outfit, and he was like, "Hey guys, I'm back," and then everyone thought they were trans. That would have been the worst thing to ever happen optically. That's like the worst case of auto balance ever. That is the worst. That is that is that that. God, I awful. I don't know, it's just the teams are uneven. You've been moved to blue team. Yeah, sometimes, you know, that's the way it goes. Sometimes, like, eventually one of your friends get out of balance. And that's the way... That's the way she goes. But you don't oh, want gosh. it to be someone like Shadman. <laughs> you, oh, no. you, want, you want that guy to stay on Team Red. Forever. Oh. <laughs> Forever. Forever. Have you seen that movie, sir? No. The Sandlot? You have it. You like baseball. Oh, oh you the, Sandlot. Seen the Sandlot. No, 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 I don't remember. I, I, you know, I've, I've seen the Sandlot the least out of any of the baseball movies. I'm more of a major league guy. What? 
Fair enough, I guess. The Sandlot's like classic though. That's like the best like kid movie. It's more of a kid they movie say than a baseball movie to me. I don't, I don't know, but like I remember like being like ten and just like being very titillated by hearing like a kid's movie say shit. Oh, that that that's that's something. Like hearing minor swearing in like a movie when like you're young. Yeah, but then you watch South Park and you get sensitized to it. Oh yeah. How do you think this new South Park generation of Fujos is gonna like treat the earlier episodes? Do you think that they're gonna have like watch lists? Are they like secondaries who don't watch the show? Probably I don't, not. I, I don't quite get it. They've watched only Tweak and Craig. Yeah, that's weird. Cause like, it's like people watching the show and being like, "Huh, this is this is homophobic," but people thought this was funny back then, huh? A girl that watches like uh, the episode of like uh, South, Park, like they're watching it for tweaking Craig. It's like I love them. I love my problematic gay boys, my Ace Arrow huh. boys, and then they watch like the episode like Eek a Penis or like any of the trans episodes, any oh, of the that... Mrs. Garrison episodes. Is like, oh. <laughs> they, had to, they had to walk that back like a, like three times, and it's very funny that they had to they keep doing they're, it. They're they're the most they're the most sorry for the the, the global warming episodes though. Oh, that one, yeah. The they had to do a two parter one. apologizing for it. God. Yeah. Well, how'd that I happen? Think of one. I'm think of one. Like, oh my god. Because they had a couple that like early on were just weird duds. Like, they had the sexual harassment panda one, and then they had... I've talked about people this before, like, people but People like that episode, though. Um, they had the one good, where, uh... But... They had the one where they go, actually, secondhand smoking is not harmful, because Rob Reiner is really annoying. That seems like... That seems like... That seems like something I would, like, make if I was, like, like, 10% less politically aware. The show's not, it doesn't have that, like, weird libertarian streak it used to have. I'm gonna be honest, if I, if, if I was, like, 10, maybe 10% 10 less politically aware, I would probably be, like, Trey Parker or Matt Stone. Oh, man. As a person. No, <laughs> that's, like, that's, like, the thing, you, you become like that if you go straight from art school to TV and then you never leave. Whereas yeah. now they have, like, kids and they're like, oh, we don't want kids to watch what we've made. What we episode, don't want our what children. What episode do you think they're the most scared of? Um, probably the, I would say the one that aged, like, the worst in the current discourse, probably the Miss Garrison one. The one where Mr. Garrison gets a sex change, and then they cut to, like, real SRS. Um. Now, like, oh, it's perfectly natural. It's like, oh, boy. If only you knew. Uh, People are going to get so mad at you. Count counterpoint, counterpoint. That isn't their worst trans episode. Oh. Everything regarding Caitlyn Jenner. The entire everything regarding the introduction to PC principle and all that was just saying like um oh man was like riff that one. yeah no like stunning and brave like that entered well, the that Jenner entered the sucks but she like, does but like that's not why they were making fun of her oh that's funny yeah no, like PC principle was like the one joke character everyone loves PC principle yeah, well, yeah right everyone in college when that ha the transport debate episode yeah exactly. Like, they had a lot of stuff that, like, it's newer stuff that didn't go well. And it's like, uh, the Caitlyn Jenner one is, I think, um, because it, it, it entered Stunning and Brave into the lexicon. Oh, that's right. Yeah, whoops. Yeah, that, because, it, it, like, they were all just riffing on the concept of, like, supporting trans women is cringe. That's it. <laughs> that's that's what that whole thing was. I think they did have to have, like, a couple. Yeah, the new season is them kind of, like, being like, uh... Sorry no, they, about they, that. They, 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 they weren't saying so much saying sorry about that, but they're trying to make print PC principle less one-dimensional, because that was there was no way that was gonna have legs. That's bizarre. It's, it's a, like one of those things where you have just kind of been grandfathered in because you've been on TV for so long. Yeah. Where it's like you, you've seen like The Simpsons, like uh, The Simpsons owns SJWs, and it's like no, Homer shouldn't have an iPhone. It should be a static timeline. Yeah, Homer should not know what like YouTube is. There, there was like the newer season of South Park, and I they're gonna tackle recasting characters as different races in the newest episode. Are you ready for that? Uh, Wonder how that's three, gonna that's, go. That's that's that would have absolutely killed like three years ago. They had a good streak for the past two years, though. I'll I will give them that. Which yeah. I didn't think they'd ever recover from like the serialized episodes ever. Boy, yeah. Bad. 
Did you know Archer lasted like 14 seasons? Yeah, and they did like five different time periods in it. Yeah, that's boy, that's... <laughs> I don't know. I, I, don't, I, I just hope the newest South Park stuff is funny. I don't really... I don't know. It's it's funny that, like, they're still three years behind, like, current discourse, and the show takes, like, a week to make. They used to be still, on top of it. Things still have to go through, like, the pipeline to get to, like, Boomer Facebook. Well, so they're, I think, they're a little bit behind. I think that, like, it's natural because they got old. And it's, I mean, yeah. it's jarring because they stayed young a little bit longer than most. A little so bit I longer. Like, there was like Boomer TV trying to like tackle the alt right when that was a thing, and they were like, "He's going on incel websites. He's getting black pilled. And just like, <laughs> He's taking the black pill." Yeah, I, I. Although, although that's had some of the best. That was some of the best TV. Was like the GamerGate SVU episode. I love oh that. Oh my god. We, we've, we've been over that. It's so good. I remember that South Park did an episode riffing on the problem with a poo, where they had Mr. They, they except they were like doing that with Mr. Hanky. <laughs> I I don't I never watched the actual episode. There's certain we were seasons... talking about we were talking about a poo earlier, and I think they just killed him off. They they just like unpersoned him. They, they didn't even give him a send off. Not even a goodbye. Um... No, he just got unpersoned. Could have just recasted him like they did with Carl and just not had his stuff be insensitive. Yeah, no, I mean they could have just been like. You can still you know, run the quickie the, mark. the voice actor was just like, yeah, I probably shouldn't be doing like a fake Indian voice. Maybe like they just promote him to like quickie mark corporate or something. I don't know. Maybe. Have you seen like have you seen like live readings of King of the Hill where it's just a white guy doing Khan's voice? No, but I know that he's a white guy. <laughs> That's that that footage of that is incredible. I've done Khan's voice on K Zone. <laughs> but so, yeah, no, I'm I i would imagine. <laughs> You're just like, uh you can't be talking like that. <laughs> You can't be talking like that, white baby. That you one took that one took a like while for people to realize, like maybe we shouldn't do that. I, that's a recent yeah. thing that people realize, like yeah, wait, that's really racist. Yeah, you, you probably should be just like doing a racist accent, like. Yeah, but like yelling "min" is very funny, and then saying Bobby Hill is ODing on fentanyl. Oh man. I'm trying to think of like speaking of like the like people getting canceled. You know Roseanne, right? That old TV show. Yes, they. Well, they brought it. They brought it back, and Roseanne got like the actress got canceled. Yup. And they canonically had Roseanne yep. die die from like fentanyl. Yup. <laughs> I remember that. That great. They like she died from like opio like opiates. I thought they would just gonna have her die of cancer. I didn't know they were gonna go like the tragic route. That's funny. Yeah. No, it's crazy. That's so cool. More shows you Yeah, do Roseanne, that. Roseanne OD. My mom watches Nautic. a lot of soap operas, so I gotta ask her what the craziest death she's ever seen was, because those, those are crazy. Oh man. Soap operas, because they'll just be like, oh yeah, no, three seasons were just a dream. 20 years ago, Hassan Piker would have gotten into being a soap opera actor with his looks instead of like sitting on a couch doing Twitch. That's, yeah. What are, That's like, not a joke. That's probably what would have happened. <laughs> I was thinking about that, like, blonde chick from the Planet of the Base video, and she would have had, like, a three-season sitcom if this was 2008. That guy, like, normies love his stuff, but, like, he will never make anything that makes us laugh. That, that, is, that is the most accidentally striking gold thing in the world, and you're never, he's never going to get that again. I've seen his other stuff. It's not as good. I don't like it. But like he, he's good enough for normies, and that put him on the map, so he's gonna be fine. That we, is kind of just the thing with a lot of online comedy. You just gotta like do it until you hit oil. Yeah, and then like whatever, whatever your normal stuff is, you'll get traction with uh, whomever, and that's that. There you go. What were we talking about? Uh, we were talking about uh, Roseanne dying. <laughs> Roseanne dying. Yeah, God. Oh man, I love. Uh... <laughs> I'm scrolling up to see what we were talking about. What's that? Everyone's saying, yeah, "Oh yeah, no, we were, like we were talking about we were talking about 
Khan. We were talking about Khan and oh, white yeah. people doing like racist voices for cartoons. Yeah, no, I, it's like I I, it's I, I promise the chat that I have never, ever on K Zone, ever done a con voice. No, look that up <laughs> if you have the time. Look up like live readings of like King of the Hill scripts and there is just yeah, you're like watching him do it and you're like, I don't think that's okay. Look up on YouTube, Serb Con Imitation Compilation 2022. <laughs> wow. Am I stuck? Kong stuck. Oh no. Kong stuck. Ac no, actually stuck. He's actually stuck. Oh my god. He's actually, he's <laughs> actually stuck. Oh no. He's no. actually. He's actually, he's actually stuck. Make sure you subscribe, everyone. We gotta get him out of there. Fuck you. Hello, Minmod. Hello, Minmod. How are you? I hate the way. Look at his fur looks. It's so disgusting. Oh my god. We're actually stuck. Do I, do I, do I load something? You, you gotta, you gotta get out of there. We got, we got a little, we got a little bit longer. Can go with this. A little bit longer. Just a little bit longer. How many people we got? 140. Yeah, that's good. Yeah! I was down I was uh I was in downtown Montreal today and there was like a massive pro Palestine rally. Dude, this yeah, is, uh, it's shifting. That, that's that's unthinkable. That's like crazy. Dude, alright. What would the fuck was with every political person hedging their bets on the whole Palestine thing in the beginning there? I saw everyone say like, no, well, uh, actually, uh, Palestine's the one that's the ones that are attacking Israel. Yeah, it's like we're defending ourselves from these like this open air prison that's full of children that we have for some reason. Yeah, that was really, really, really weird where I saw like left wing people like Vouch like hedging their bets on like oh man Palestine. yeah yeah they were hedging their bets and being like actually israel's kind of might be the good guys and then that's it became because, and then yeah. it became indefensible that's because Vouch's job is to like lead you on a big goose chase that just ends with you voting for the democrats yep that's contra points his job too but no one wants to talk about that that's all of them It's like, whoa, whoops. Yeah, expect this next election period where if you aren't voting Democrat, people are going to call you a bad person. Yeah, guess what, folks? We got to support Israel on the stream. Guess what? I, I was shocked because they were like... The hysterical tone where it's like, look, we need to just... Like, what? wait. And people, like, normal people are being like, wait. Why is there just, like, an open-air prison that all my money goes to? <laughs> You're actually figuring out what Israel is. Israel. Wait, you're telling me you're telling me that we have like a, a Ford operating base that operates on like a master race ideology. Man, where have we heard that before? Yeah, no, it's like, oh wait, this is <laughs> man, just fascism. Man, where has that ever happened before? I don't oh. know. I don't know. I, I'm not really well read on like history. They're doing- they're doing their own holocaust over there. <laughs> well, it looks like- it looks like they're doing their own- Bobby, they're doing their own holocaust. Dad! Connie Dad. Dad! Dad! Connie tells- tells me she's been watching Vouch, and that we should hedge our bets on Israel. <laughs> we found a Kong statue, no. by the way. Uh, Bobby, I don't think we would support Israel. But- Dad! Dad, the YouTubers are in disagreement. I can't do voices right now, my throat's too dry. What is that? What is that? Dad, dad. But dad, I really love Vape Nation. <laughs> oh. Now, Bobby, Bobby, like, I love the idea of, like, turning to your favorite YouTuber for comfort. I mean, like, can you please tell me what to think? Ethan Klein, please show me the way. <laughs> oh, he was going nuts. He was like, well, I hope someone bombs you, Hassan. Honestly, never thought I'd say this, but, like, yep, I know. Upsta like, we gotta give him credit. He, right when it was, like, the least popular opinion, he was actually, like, right there. He was right there, and he, like, was just like, for the, for the stuff about Israel-Palestine, 
props, honestly. Uh, that, we're just watching. Are we going to comment on that bird that we're just watching? I was waiting for you. I'm just watching the bird. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> you killed the bird. Oh, no. God, I love being alive. I love it. It's good. What a great time to be alive. I have. You might actually live to see Israel get dismantled. How cool, how cool is that? I never thought that that would actually be something that would happen. That's how cool is that? You might actually live to see Israel just get like taken apart. Yeah. Just at least make it smaller. Oh, it's like. You're gonna have you're gonna have like a predominantly Jewish country, but just like. Just, just don't be like committing genocide not, over not it. Not like, yeah. Just stop doing, just stop doing war crimes, Israel. Yeah, yeah. Attention, Israel. Attention, attention, Israel. Attention. Da 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 da. Serb news update. Serb tonight. Stop doing war crimes now. War criminal. War criminal. War criminal. <laughs> Benjamin Netanyahu's our sterling boy. I have never had a country- I don't know, it's like... Maybe just having a country straight up stop it. Like, this might be the end for them. They need to ha do something in a WWE with, like, uh... Just like what John Cena did where he announced that uh, Bin Laden's been compromised to a, per a permanent end. He should do something <laughs> about that where they dissolve <laughs> Israel. Ladies and gentlemen, the nation of Israel has been dismantled. There will be no more genocide on the Gaza Strip. <laughs> yeah! And they bring... Because <laughs> it's like, they, there's like a deliberate obfuscation of like the, the issue. It's like, they're like, oh guys, this is the most complicated issue of our time. And then you look over there and it's like, wait, they just have a prison that they can't leave? It's very <laughs> straightforward. You, you, you would think your instinct would be to hedge your bets because nothing is that black and white. No, it actually look, look is. Yeah, it turns out, it turns out it's, uh, yeah. They're, they're, they're doing their own holocaust. They, they want to beat the high score. They're competitive. They're crazy about it. Um, but yeah. Um, how about this, how about this video game? <laughs> how about, how about Kong Skull Island, everyone? No, Israel's unique because it is like a country from the 19th century. It's just like... Like a settler colonial like thing out in the Middle East. It's like, oh, we're going on a nice expedition. They all talk like the Jumanji guy about they all like talk like that guy from Jumanji. About like, but he's like selling shitty ecstasy them. to people. Except he's an EDM artist. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that is after like a full week, like the entire decapitated baby thing just fell apart. That's crazy. They're just like, ah, oh, shit. Everyone else is getting a country. Why? Why? We should have a country. I mean, there, there should be like a predominantly Jewish country, but it shouldn't be doing genocide over it. I mean, you, I mean, you, yeah, it's shit. Everyone else has one, so that's probably why. Everyone they're... else has got a god. Everyone else has got a country. So why can't we? Have all right. A country? All right. All right. Now, now, now the tables are even. I think every every single major religion's caused at least one genocide now. Yeah, except no, the Scientologists like, until they do their own Heaven's Gate thing. Just the, uh, didn't they like try and put them in the Soviet Union and like no one wanted to go? Like Stalin tried to give them like a like a, a zone or something and like no one wanted it. Well, because this is the Soviet Union, no one really wants anything there. <laughs> oh jeez. I, I can't blame them. <laughs> I'd be I'd be a little bit choosy too. I'd be like, eh. yeah, it's like in the middle of like Siberia. I mean, you have the have the upper hand of them fe feeling bad for you, so you might as oh, well try to milk it. I was on the border with China. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Could you, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> could you imagine if they did that? That that that, that would make Chinese Jews a reality. That would oh, be. Oh, I can imagine you would like not trust like the Russians like after like how they treated you. That would make Chinese Jews a reality. That would be a very powerful combination. 
Sort of like how you have like the the the, the Catholic uh, Japanese, where they have that one thing where they said that Jesus Christ, uh, the tomb of Jesus Christ, in Japan, that he oh died god. at at age. Uh... Have you ever heard of this? No. What are you talking about? Oh my god! Hold on. No, this is this is worth this is worth bringing up. Go, please, by all means, lead the way. J Japan Tomb of Christ. <laughs> Christ found in Japan, real. Is this in Japan? Garden Tomb... Wait, let me see. Because Vine Sauce Joel... Tomb of Christ! Yeah, they have a Tomb of Christ in Japan. We gotta go there, oh my god. Christ's grave! Yes! 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 Here it is, I'm gonna put it up on stream. Jesus found in Japan. This is this is very informative. Uh, Rocky, I want you to tab into the. Uh, I'm gonna send this to you. All right, uh, no, I can see it. I'm okay, ready. Okay, I want I'm you oh my to God. read it. Read it to chat. Uh, when Jesus Christ was 21 years old, he came to Japan and pursued knowledge of divinity for 12 years. He went back to Judea at age 33 and engaged in his mission. However, at that at that time, people in Judea would not accept Christ's preaching. Instead, they arrested him and tried to crucify him on a cross. His younger brother, Isukiri, casually took Christ's place and ended his life on the cross. Christ, who escaped the crucifixion, went through the ups and downs of travel and again came to Japan. He settled right here in what is now called Hurei Village and died at the age of 106. It, on this holy ground, there is dedicated a burial mound on the right to deify Christ and a grave on the left to deify Isukiri. The above description was given in a testament by Jesus Christ. I yeah no I'm surprised you'd ever heard of that. Uh, that. That body we dug up was actually liquid. <laughs> yeah, um, that's 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 worth bringing up. I I personally believe. I thank you. So I now know about Japan, like Japan Jesus. Yes, it's awesome. That's a story that needed to be told. Good segues now. Only the best here. Where do I go? I was busy thinking about the mysteries of the Catholic Church. Oh, yeah? Yeah, like, Isakuri Christ. <laughs> Isakuri Christ, yeah. The Last Temptation of Isakuri. Is that a Mooney's cult thing? I don't know. I, I, I don't. don't know. That's like, I remember reading about, like, Om Shinrikyo, where it was just like, he was just like, oh, actually, every single religion is true. But I'm going to take all of them and make a super religion. <laughs> Just like... Have you, what's your favorite thing about Scientology? And here's here's hard mode because I know you'll say it. You can't say anything about Bart's voice actress recruiting people in her voice on voice calls. Uh, my favorite anecdote about Scientology is Tom Cruise casually bringing up how he wanted to run through a field of flowers with Nicole Kidman. And the Scientology guy being like, alright, I'll do it. And he like made an entire field of flowers for Tom Cruise. That's beautiful. Oh, you know about the the audio of uh, voice um, that uh, Nancy Cartwright would leave for uh, Scientology oh, of fundraisers? Course, yes. Can you link that to me in chat so I can play that for chat? Uh, yes. So I don't pause is, the this game. This is an iconic Bart thing. Yeah, yeah. Link that to me in chat and I'll play. It, it. is literally Bart Simpson called me at 3 a.m. It is awesome. We can't, we can't not, we can't not talk, talk about that. Here you go. Okay, here we go. This is this is Bart called me on my phone. <laughs> it's called Bart Simpson promoting Scientology. <laughs> hey, what's happening, man? This is Bart Simpson. Oh, this is standing there. <laughs> Just kidding. Don't hang up. This is Nancy Cartwright, and this is a very special phone call to you. I'm now auditing on New OT7, and have been asked to speak at the Flag World Tour event on January 31st in the Grand Ballroom at the Hollywood and Highland Center at 6.30 p.m. It's going to be a blast, man. <laughs> I will be there to share my many wins as a solo NOS auditor and to see the golden era film presentation of Flag, the mecca of technical perfection. I hope you can make it, man. To confirm for the Flag event, please call us back at 888-841-7131. That's 888-841-7131. Eight four one seven one three one. See you there, man. <laughs> um, do you remember being a kid and like finding out that Bart was voiced by a girl and it like being a big thing? 
I, I that my version of that was when that Timmy Turner is voiced by a girl. Yeah, Tara Strong, who had some incredible comments. Oh, on here Twitter. we go. We got another segue. Yeah, I oh. She... My absolute, my absolute favorite Zionist person on Twitter is uh, the guy from Disturbed, David Draham, where he's like, "Fuck, fuck Palestine, hashtag Israel." He's like, he's like that shit. Mine is uh, Ben Dreyfus. Oh yes. Or oh man, you 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 read off his uh, his tweet that he made. It, it, this is baffling. Oh, yes, here we go, yes. Yes, read that off for us. Okay, this is an incredible tweet. I actually don't think that the left has begun to grapple with how angry they have made American Jews. I am incredibly mad at them. I just saw a tweet that had nothing to do with this and I almost retweeted it just to own libs, but then was like, wait, Ben, you're pro-trans. <laughs> but doctor, I am Pagliacci. I almost became- I was so angry, I almost became transphobic. Unbelievable. I can't believe- I can't believe that the entire po I can't believe Floride Brain is causing the war in Gaza. Unbelievable. <laughs> Getting mad at Floride Brain. Floride Brain is doing this right now. As we speak. <laughs> oh, man. Drawing Varg Vikreens and Yui Hirasawa from k -On together. I, lo I love her art. We need to commission her sometime. Why I'm leaving the left. Why I'm leaving the left. It's just a picture of, like, her, one of her sad girl drawings. It's like, I'm leaving the left because of this. <laughs> <laughs> this is why. Getting so mad you become transphobic. I like that they're doing the guys with like the Jews are literally shaking right now. Jews are so scared. Yeah, I don't. I'm also seeing a bunch of like Pepe the Frog guys like getting like so I, I don't know being so, getting so mad at Chapo that they're tr duping themselves into becoming pro-Israel. Yeah, which no, I never that's, thought that's, I would that, see coming. That's an incredible level of like contrarianism. That's just being, that's just like giving away the lead that like you are mad at this person because they are popular and that you don't like them. You don't believe in anything. You're just mad at people. It's a lot of like Ukraine people and like the, the, the like incredible people on there are like the guys who are still like demanding that politicians bomb Syria. Like <laughs> we need to go and kill Assad. What time, I, what time do I got in this game? You Hold got 20 on. more minutes. No, I got check in my internal clock. Oh my god. You're getting pecked to death by birds, by the way. It's fine. It's not fine. You're dying. 89 minutes. 89 minutes. So that's... Oh my god. What's Bappin? Like, finding out that guy is still going after, like, seven years. He's still condemning the left for, like, being pro-Assad. 89 minutes. So that would be... So 90 minutes would be 30 minutes. So I have about 30 more minutes. All right. Well, let's just peck me to death. <laughs> no! Kong! But yeah, it's really... We aren't getting... I don't even know how long this game is. We are. We should have bought. We should have bought the incest game. I'm so serious right now. That's that's porn. We, we can't. Hit, that's top. It's not porn at all. Is it? It's, I just, can, uh, it's just risk. I would have bought it. And played it. If someone buys that for me, content? I'll stream it. What's the content of there? I don't know. know. It's about. A brother and sister practicing cannibalism after witnessing a botched satanic ritual. Yeah, someone buy that for me. Oh, so it's not porn? No, it's just a weird, it's just a game that's weird. Oh. You're kidding me. That's, people are mad at that? Eh. Can't make anything transgressive in Detroit. Can't have shit. <laughs> It's got themes, Serb. How dare they? 
I know. Well, it's like, it's like, imagine like a horror game, but you've never played anything but like Garden of Ban Ban. Oh yeah, like, so like a, like a horror game that actually has scary themes in it, like abuse. And it's actually frightening and not just like... It's about frightening things that can happen in real life, like abuse and sexual assault and all that crap. Yeah, real, real scary things. Like, yeah. Yeah, people have been doing that lately, where they get mad at stuff for using that in horror stuff. Yeah, they're like, um, you're talking about abusive relationships. Like, yeah, it's it's fiction. You're supposed to talk about real... You're meant to talk about fucked up shit. It's like you're you, allowed, you want it's not your, real. You want your horror to be something... You want horror games to be something you read a wiki about, not get scared at. That's exactly... Yeah, no, exactly. It's like, I, I need to I need to be reading a wiki and, like, understanding the lore. You want... And not, like, actually being scared. I don't want to think. I just want to read wiki and, like... I want to read wiki. That's weird. Uh, it's, that's not going to go away for a while. Keep this no, that, yeah, that that Insta game sold well. It's bizarre, and the answer, like the reason, it like, you know, the 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 key is to just not have social media, and not have like a direct line where people can yell at you. People also, you gotta realize, people also forget about stuff like that so oh, yeah. fast. People will be mad you at you watch, for three I, months I, at I, I don't know if I asked you this yet, sir. Did you watch The Amazing Digital Circus? Um, I skipped around and it looks visually pretty good. Um, I don't have the attention span to, like, sit down and watch it, though. I haven't I, had the free I, time either. I quite liked it, but, like, here's the thing. I was talking about this on the stream the other night, but, like... You asked me I about think it. people... Like, no, people... People forget, like, new people are always turning 14. Yeah. I, I, like, they're like, oh, I'm 26. And it's like, yeah, you're probably not going to like this show because you're 27 years old. And people also want to be contrarian because they like to... People value... It's what I like to call V 3 by 3 brain. Where, yeah. like, they, they want to... They, they, they value liking the right media more than liking what they actually like. So That's you'll exactly it, yeah. So you'll see people say something contrarian to get ahead of the curve. For no other sake than to be one of the people that could say, I was right about this first, in case it's it just, suddenly becomes cringe. It is one of those things where it's like, because I remember people do this with everything. They were like, oh, I bet the fandom for this is going to be so bad. And it's like, you you don't ever have to actually engage but Pagliacci, with the fandom. But Pagliacci, you are the fandom. Bro, dog. Like, you, like, I remember people do this like, oh, dude, the Pizza Tower fandom is so bad. It's like, yeah, you, you, you don't This is to... news to me because that's just a game. No. People did that. People did that with Cuphead, too. They're like, guys, the Cuphead fandom is so bad. It's like, no, that's just a game. That's like a it's good a, game. Do you remember when people were, were like, I remember there's this one tweet where, like, someone was like, my teacher wouldn't let us watch Cuphead in class. It's like, that's a cartoon. That's a, that's a cartoon. That, like, that was a bad cartoon. That... I mean, I didn't watch the cartoon because I'm an adult, but like I've known Cuphead, well, yeah. Cuphead, Cuphead was a good video game. Pizza Tower was a good video game. It's like, well, I, I can't like it doesn't really matter what other people think. Well, like a lot of the stuff yeah. I hate is shit that people think is terrible. Like, I mean, my favorite video game is Kane and Lynch 2 and like everyone fucking hates that game. <laughs> like, well. Mona friend zone fandoms toxic. I saw someone made a subreddit for us the other day. I was looking, I, and I someone made one. Look. No uh, one, no, hilarious. there's nothing there. Hilarious. Get rid someone of it. Needs to make, someone needs to make an ironic TV tropes page for us and just be like, there's one for uh, Rocky, Rocky, Rocky has elements of the trickster. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, the the brief kimono friend zone wiki. I got rid of that. I was the one that got rid of that. Good job. Yeah. Uh, oh man. Because my, my profile page was me face tapped as a girl, and I don't like that. That's very funny. I do, oh my god, sir. Do you, like, do you know that like Yik has unironic defenders now? Did they get better now? Well, no. See, I I was like, I made a tweet a while back that was like, oh hey, you know, the the new Yik patch looks like they're improving on what was wrong with the base game, and I had like four people come at me being like, uh, clearly you just didn't understand Yik. You lack reading comprehension. And it's like, no, I played through that whole game. That game sucks dick. But like, there is like a, a like a layer of irony you can get to where you just unironically think Yik is really good. 
Like you just come out the other side and are like, oh, actually, this game is amazing. But like that is that is absolutely the kind of person who would love Yik. <laughs> did you soft lock yourself? I think I did. Oh my god, you did! You have no help. How? <laughs> Yeah, the dead zone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you saw like yourself. Sorry. I think it's a good time to, to to part ways now. I think that might be the end. Yeah, I think we've gotten all we can. I think we got all the blood we can get out of this stone. <laughs> yeah, that was good. Good, good showing everybody. Thank you for coming, everyone. We'll see you next week. Serb's got faith tomorrow. A really cool looking game. But uh, youtubecom friends Welcome. If you like what you saw. Make sure you subscribe. Excuse. Oh no, not this. It's just, excuse me. Oh, thank you so much for coming. I am going to bed now. Goodbye. Uh, that was uh, a good this game. Uh, buy it for me. <laughs> coming soon. Coming soon to K Zone. Oh, let, me see, let me see if we could raid anybody. Is anyone even on? Yeah, there? raid. Uh, raid Chapo. They'll pay it forward. Okay. Rocky, why do you talk like that? Well, I don't know, so leave me be. Yeah, they'll pay it forward eventually. Good night, gamers. We love you.